Father! 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 Father. Wait, Wait for, for us. us! Can we watch? Yeah. We want to watch you judge. Adonijah. <laughs> Solomon, I told you before. Please, Father. We'll be good. Please, dear king, hear my case today. I need your wise judgment. I beg you, King David, please. Come, I will hear your case first. At first, just a few of my sheep were missing, but then more and more. Now they're all gone. A few days ago, I came to a place where your soldiers meet. And, and there I found my sheep, or what was left of them. The soldiers stole them for food. Are you sure? I found these there. All of my sheep wore them. This is my mark. If this is true, sir, the soldiers will be punished. And I will not rest until they have given you four times what they have stolen. Thank you, sir. Thank you. I'm sending for the captain of that... You've lied to me. Sir? This is a plot. To increase your herd. No, I... I... The rest of your sheep aren't dead. They're hidden in a mountain cave, aren't they? Aren't they? Uh, yes, yes. Prepare yourself, Solomon. I will die soon, and you will be king. Father, I could never judge like you. Never. You will. You must. <laughs> Tomorrow's the day. We'll hold a celebration for the whole city. Then you, Abiathar, will crown me king of Israel. It could be dangerous. If David finds out... <laughs> He can't do anything. He's too old. What about Solomon? David did say that he should be the next king. Well, he won't be. I am the oldest brother. I will be king. Besides, if anyone interferes, they'll have to deal with me and the army of Israel. Oh, Adonijah. And a night of why? You must act quickly, King David. The future of Israel depends on you. But what shall I do? He is my son. David, I speak to you as a prophet in Israel. Put your love for Adonijah aside and save your country. Yes, Israel. Israel must go on. Here is what you should do. Solomon, son of David, according to the will of the Lord of hosts, I anoint you king of Israel. But Adonijah was just crowned king. Yes, Adonijah is the oldest son. King David was once the youngest of all his brothers, and yet the Lord made him king. He has done the same with Solomon. But what will happen to Adonijah? Adonijah is in the Lord's hands. Behold Solomon, your new king. We'll be accused of treachery. We'll be hanged. Get a hold of yourself. We have control of the army. Joab and his soldiers will defend us. My soldiers are all down there. You can't. 
can't kill me. I I'm holding the horns of the altar. Solomon! If I must be king, I will not live in fear. Kill me now, if that is your plan. Otherwise, go home and never challenge God's will again. see too, but th there could be more. But what about Asa? We can't just leave him there. All we can do is hope he had time to hide. Over here. I found one. Huh? Huh? Uh. There's one. Let's get him. This is the end for you, Israelite. For my family, my country, and my God! Asa was a great soldier, a kind man. I know. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Can't you do anything right? Oh, oh, I'm so sorry. I'll, I'll, I'll just clean that right up. Never mind that. Just get the food. Six more goblets of wine, two more loaves of bread, dates, cream, butter. <laughs> Where's the butter? Innkeeper? Uh, coming right away. <laughs> we aim to serve. I have pretty good aim myself. <laughs> Priscilla, please, isn't there something you can do? Quit throwing food at my husband. He doesn't like it. With everything I do, you'd think I could get a little help. I'm expecting. So was the mother of Moses. They're murdering me out there. Who's that? It's your Uncle Isaac from Samaria. How am I supposed to know? Excuse me, sir. I need a place to stay. My husband died, and my house... Go away! Can't you see we're busy? I'm busy? You're filing your nails into stubs! Oh, please. I'll work in exchange for a place to sleep. You won't even have to pay me. Innkeeper! Let us say there are two men. The first man comes before you and says, This man has stolen my axe. I saw him do it. The second man says, I did not. But you know the second man to be a liar. He's stolen several axes before. Furthermore, the first man is honest and good. What do you do? I would punish the second. No, dear king. Remember, the law says there must be two witnesses before a man can be punished. Ah, oh, yes. <laughs> of course. <clears throat> Let us say a man marries a woman, then dies. 
Then his eldest brother must marry the widow. Good. But what if he refuses? There's so much to know. So much to learn. Now this is the way things should be. Why, thank you. <laughs> I finally got some help. Yes, I see. You're a good worker, miss. Thank you, sir. Where did you find her? Oh, she came here looking for work. I suppose you're proud of yourself. Pride is a luxury I cannot afford. You're so good. What... what is it? What happened? I think... I think it's time. Time? Time for what? You mean... oh, you don't mean that. You're going to have the baby? Whoa, right now? I think... oh, I think... Not you, too! Don't just stand there. A kitchen is no place for a baby to be born. Right. Uh, uh, right, right. Clear the way. This lady needs some help. Take it easy, miss. Heat up some water. Here, take my hand. Someone open the door. How will I do what my father has done, Lord? How? Solomon, speak. What is it you stand in need of? What I need, Lord, is an understanding heart. You've asked me to rule in righteousness, and I feel no wiser than a little child. I need wisdom, Lord. Solomon, my son, because you have asked for the wisdom to do good and not for personal gain, I will give thee the wise and understanding heart you asked for. Behold, there will have been none wiser nor shall there ever be any wiser than you. Thou art kind. Thank you, Lord. Thank you. Judge, can we watch? Adonijah, <laughs> Solomon, 
I've told you before. Please, Father, we'll be good. Sir? wasn't mine. It was hers. It's a lie, your highness. This baby is mine. I promise you'll have your chance to speak. Go on. I warned her many times about sleeping too close to her child, but she wouldn't listen. I told her to be careful, that she might roll over on the child in the night. Lies. Lies. I was the one who warned her. I warned her. <laughs> Why are you doing this to me? What proof do you have, good woman, that this child is yours? A mother knows her child, sir. I know my child. She's lying, sir. <laughs> I beg you. Give me back my child. God in heaven, please give me the gift you promised. Bring me a sword. Good. Now take it and cut the child in two. Sir? Cut the child in two and give each mother half. I have spoken. No, it's hers. I lied. I lied. The child belongs to her. The baby is hers. Will you remain silent? You are the king. Thy will be done. A true mother would do anything to save the life of her child. Oh, my baby. My baby. Long live Solomon. Solomon with 
friends.